Hey guys, what's up? Ashley here, and it's day number 27 of Giggling. Welcome back to another edition of Confessions of Giggler, and I'm here at the Grand Casino where I've been, and you know, I don't know if you could see them up there, but Jer and Deb are here, otherwise known as Mrs. Claus and her sister. <laughs> oh my gosh, so I just got some some breakfast, just a just an oatmeal. Oh shoot, I have to pick that up. I made a mess. Oatmeal and a coffee, and then we're gonna be off to Epcot for Festival of Arts today, and I'm so excited because I think it might be my favorite festival. I don't know, but it's a tough call, but I do really love it. Uh, so let's see what kind of delicious foods we eat today and any kind of fun art we see. I'm just excited to get the day going. Yay. <laughs> Yay! Thank you. Here we are at Festival of the Arts. Are you guys excited for the day? Yes, I'm excited! excited. <laughs> look, at, look at the besties. <laughs> oh my gosh. I uh, Look, Deb, I just want to point this out. Do you see how this tube of paint is pink? And then all the flowers are pink? Oh, how cute is that? Right? It's so cute. I love it. Yay. So we're here at Epcot and we just stopped in the creation shop so me and Jared could get our new magnets. Aren't they so cute? A little Dumbo. I love it so much and it's hot pink and well more like a bubblegum pink but either way I'm so happy that we were able to get it. My hair's already a disaster but that's okay. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Hold on. Alright. Um, <laughs> I'm holding this with my wrong hand. But I was just in Norway and I got myself school bread. I love school bread so much and I don't I can't tell you the last time I had it because like every time I'm here it's festival time and I'm like fill up on all the festival foods, but I got this anyway. Jared and Deb are at the Painted Panda, which is the China, the, the booth in China, and they got some snackies for us there, so we're going to go and eat that, we're going to enjoy this, and I'm just so happy to be eating delicious food, because that's what I love. <laughs> Alright, here we have the, the General Chow Shu Mai, I'm very excited to try that, and the pork bun, which is probably also very good, because I love that kind of bao bun bread. And my school bread. My delicious school bread. Jerry, are you excited to try this stuff? Jerry never would have tried this stuff if I didn't push her. But never. now she now she likes it. Right, Jerry? Yeah. She's all excited to try the bow marrow. <laughs> we are We'll get that on video, don't you worry. <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> Alright. Someone try something and let us know how it tastes. <laughs> Alright, Deb. What's your review? It's talking about crunchy. It's delicious. Yeah, the, the, that's the shumai, the general chow shumai, right? Jar, what do you think about the shumai? Delicious. All right, I'm gonna try it soon. Okay, that was delicious. The delicious. Uh, delicious. I think I like the the pork bun better than the shumai, but the, both of them were really really good. Um, but like I said, I really love like the bao bun type of bread. And the the pork was cooked like like if you ordered um, like short ribs or spare ribs from a Chinese restaurant, it was cooked like that, but yeah. like but better. Yeah. Um, a little <laughs> so, juicier. Yeah, it was it was they're really really delicious. It was two thumbs up. All right, so if you were to give Painted Panda a number out of ten, what would you say? I would say. I mean, we still have the whole the whole I would place say, to go. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna throw away. You're not gonna give well, it a ten. Yet. I'm no. You no, 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 don't no. want to give tens right now. I would say eight. Probably seven, five, seven point five. Seven and a half. Yeah, seven and a half. Maybe I'd give it like an eight. I'd give it an eight. Right. or a seven point nine, like almost an eight. Oh, almost an eight. All right, I'll do a seven point. You don't have to be influenced by me. You can, you can have your own rating. Five. Seven We're point five. All right. What does Jar say? I said an eight. An eight? Alright. 
So I think we're going to head over to Germany next and see what see what delicious treats they have there. They have pretzels. It'll be a time. <laughs> no, we got the giant pretzel there one time, and it was not good. So we'll have to go to that Wexley's place. And probably. Oh, well, no, they have the caramel store in Germany. But you can't oh, have that. Yeah. But <laughs> that's really I'm delicious. I'm diabetic, and she wants me. I know. I keep forgetting. I'm so sorry. Yeah. That makes sense. I have caramel <laughs> Alright, so we got these things from Germany, Pavilion. I don't, it's over there. Um, but here we are, we're trying. This is wild boar sausage, right, Deb? Yep. And wild it's got like sausage. beans and stuff next to it. I mean, it's in beans. I don't, and this yeah, is a. Like white beans. Beef no, something like or other. This. What was this called? Short, short rib. A short rib. And that looks like delicious balsamic glaze. I love a good balsamic glaze. Yeah. There goes Jerry in her. How was is, how is the short rib, Jerry? How's the how's the boar sausage? I love it. Love it. Love it. Mm-hmm. Oh man! All right, here goes Jerry tr trying the boar sausage. Let's let's say we're, let's tell Jerry how proud we are of her that she's trying something that's that's not in her. Uh, in her oh right, in her normal, <laughs> in her normal repertoire. Oh my god! Really oh, it's good. good. She said it's yeah. good, guys. Are we so proud of her? Me and Nike here. All right, I'll have mm. to, I'll have to try some. Mm. Okay, we clearly didn't guys. didn't enjoy this, <laughs> guys. That was so good. It was so good. Don't let the words the comfy and, and wild, wild boar, boar scare you because that might have been good. that might have been the best sausage I've ever had in my life. Yeah, it was so <laughs> it was good. So good. Plus, whatever bean concoction bean. that they had that they yeah. like had it on. It oh was my god. <laughs> so good. That will get a nine and possibly at the end may reevaluate to a 10 depending on, <laughs> depending on what, what else we have <laughs> exactly yeah i don't think jar was as like thrilled, thrilled about, about this yeah me i would just give that a seven i like the sausage but i'm not but a what about person. the booth in, in general the, so this one was the the the, oh, br the braised pork rib or what, what is it called the braised beef the braised, yeah, short yeah, rib the short rib so, i thought it was fine i i yeah, i good. i'd give this an eight I mean, because right. I like short rib beef. So why would so. give yeah, this? Yeah, I don't a, love short rib beef. So I do love it, but I didn't think that was anything spectacular. It was just like your standard right. short right. rib Right, so I would give it a seven. Right, and it had a little mashed potato and some tomatoes. Yeah. Um, right. The real star of this plate was the balsamic glaze that they had on there. Yeah, if that I was could the take, best. If I could take that balsamic glaze and pour it on the sausage, she oh man. Winner, winner, sausage dinner. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That would have been a 10. Yeah. That would have been an 11. Yeah. <laughs> that balsamic glaze was so good. Like if you could bottle that or buy it, right? Take it uh, home. Take it home. I would take it home. Yeah, it <laughs> was love. fantastic. Uh, but that sausage and the white bean, whatever, it was so good. Uh, so yeah, I would give this yeah. booth in general. Uh, let's yeah. give it like a, an eight point five. Yeah, all over eight point five. Right. We should make, we should like job. write it down in our in our booklet right. what we thought. Well, um, next to the yeah. Thing. Well, I mean, you gave it an eight point five. What do you give the booth? The whole, the booth as a whole, Jer. It, oh, the booth as a whole. Yeah. Yeah, I'd give it an eight. An eight. As a whole. The the uh, the right. we wild boar was it was ham so, hock, so good. Duck, ham hock, and wild boar sausage. Right. That was so good. <laughs> so good. With under, and underneath it was like a bean but castle. It had, because it was with cooked, a bean, white bean cooked, castle. It, it was, was cooked a, really well too. Yeah. Like it had a nice, like a little bit of a char yeah. on the outside, and we were just discussing how much we love charred food. <laughs> yeah. And and um, and the it was a over a white bean castle. Yeah. Well, whatever the fantastic. white bean castle was. Delicious. Delicious. I could have just had a bowl of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And been very happy. Yeah. I mean, we're very happy with a lot yeah. of things. Yeah. <laughs> we obviously <laughs> aren't picky eaters. Yeah. <laughs> well, Jerry is. Jerry's a picky eater. <laughs>
All right, here we go. Our next booth tasting is uh, we went to the uh, I forget how to say it, but it's the 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 booth in Japan, and we got our sushi donut and a pork sandwich with coleslaw and stuff. I think that that's going to be tasty. I think Jared will like it. She Jared will not eat this. She won't even try it, even though this is just plain white rice and a cucumber. She don't like it. She don't like it. She said she don't like it, but Deb likes it. And I like it. So we're gonna try it and it's gonna be delicious. delicious. So All right, here we go. This is delicious. This is Did you try pickled, it? I took a little piece of it. It's a little pickled slaw, right? Yeah, it's yeah, so it, in the it's good, right? Here. It's so, so you're good. Soy sauce there, Deb's so. a good uh, food food vlogger. <laughs> yeah. This is so good. It's not too pickly. Yeah. And it's just nice. Mm -hmm. And then a little bit of greens gives it a little tartness right. to go with the sweetness. Right. Okay. All right. Now we're going to hit up. You want we're going to hit up the sauce. Uh, yeah, the, uh, move sorry. this to here. All right. Here we go. All right. Action. Okay. So, both were great. The, I love the sushi donut. It's more like an appetizer than getting sushi rolls. Right. So, it's got a little bit of fresh seafood, uh, salmon, tuna, a and shrimp. shrimp. And some and, cucumber. And the pickled relish. That came with the pork sandwich. That came, actually came with the pork sandwich is fantastic. And the pork sandwich though, I didn't eat the bread. Um, it, I mean, who doesn't love fried pork, right? Right, right. Now, of the two, I, um, I, like, the sushi. I like the sushi better, but to be honest, I'd rather have a tradition, a traditional me, roll, as a bur traditional roll <laughs> um, of like tuna, uh, or, right? Or spicy tuna, yeah. That do this, this. But it, it was yeah. harder for me, right? Um, to to get eat what it, you want it, yeah. And eat it. Yeah. Sure. So. Especially yeah. as a shared thing. But like the rice, yeah, as a shared thing. But the, the rice, rice was, was really great. good. It was like top quality. and sticky enough, not too much. Right. So, Jared, what did you think of your pork sandwich? Because you didn't have the sushi roll. Yeah. Right. I thought it was very good. Um, That's it? It's a fried pork sandwich. You know, I, thought that, I thought the sauce on it was good. The sauce was good, and then I put some soy sauce on it. Yeah. Because I like the soy sauce. <laughs> Yeah, so my, my opinion is that it was very good. I mean, I've had the sushi donut before, so I know that I liked it. Um, I think that the rice is, is what is makes good, it makes it good, because the the cuts of fish itself are just okay. Yeah. Like, I've had better cuts of, of tuna before. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, last night, oh my god. We'll talk about that another time. Yeah. But um, the rice is really what sells it. Yeah. So if you like sushi rice, then get, then get this. Yeah, but, um, but like, but it's a lot. Rice, yeah. It's a lot of money for a sushi just to pay for white rice. <laughs> right. right. Um, so let's see. What what would you rate the the booth overall? All right, the whole booth overall. Yeah, yeah. I I'm mean, based on the two things we tried. On, on the lower side, um, only because I, I'm used to really good sushi places. Sure. And um, so I would probably give them six. Six. Wow. Six and a half, maybe. Six, six and a half. Jar, what did Jar think? Yeah, I probably, because I didn't have that. So I gotta right, you just get, had the pork sandwich, right? Right, the pork sandwich. So overall, I have to rate it by, you know, a five or six, five point five. Wow. Jar's, Jar's yeah, real low on the Japan. Well, because I don't like them averaging the sushi, which is zero. Yeah, but you me. can't no, average you the sushi. You can't average a zero you can in. Only Something that oh, that I tried. That you tried. Yeah, you didn't try that, so you can't count oh, that in your rating. Right, so I can't right, so you it. say, okay. But She's like, I'm. <laughs> so by by your measurements, then that was a ten. Oh. No, no. <laughs> so then I was six point five. All right. Yeah, I mean, I would do about a six, a six and a half, seven. I would say maybe like a seven. Got I'd give book? it a seven. Yeah, I'll mark it down in our book. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so on to, on to the next. On to the next. Oh, oh shoot, sorry. <laughs> so we just stopped at the Encanto booth to get empanadas, and I got this little smoothie, and it came in this cup, and it is just the cutest little cup ever, and I can't even, 
I can't even stand it. Like, look how cute it is. I am so excited for this cup. <laughs> it's a coconut and passion fruit smoothie. I just thought it would be delightful in the because it's hot. So let's. Uh, that's very tasty. All right, hold on. They need a picture. Here we go. Right behind you. Oh, I, I can't see. It's dark. I mean, it's too bright. Ooh. You see them? No, you just you just lost all your napkins. Oh well. So I gotta I gotta go. Okay, the empanadas. What do you guys think? So, I'll give it a seven. Uh -huh. I, mean, I eat a lot of empanadas. I did like the spicy mayo, but I do agree with Ashley. I think it would have been better with a salsa and a sour cream over it, or a salsa dip. Um, it's probably made Jesus. that way to make it easier. Just like it a sour a cream. I would have rather a sour cream drizzle than a mayonnaise drizzle. Right. Because that, like, my first bite, I just got a mouthful of mayonnaise, and I do not like mayonnaise, and it ruined the whole thing for me. Okay. So, I thought it was okay. It wasn't so, I give right. it, like, a three. Yeah, <laughs> so I would give it a seven. I don't like mayonnaise. Like, the inside filling was good, but I do not like mayonnaise, and it just, bleh. What did you like? Did you like it? I thought it was just, like, uh... Like, I'm not a big empanada. This one was better than normal, but so I'd probably give it a six. A little spicy, but it had the kick. I enjoyed the little kick. Yeah, yeah. I'm but feeling it right here. I in my feel it. <laughs> so it's overall, a, give it overall, six. It was tasty. But this drink six. was this oh, movie my was pina very good. Was fantastic. Yeah. My water was great. All right. Um, <laughs> great. All right, we're it's like smart, on top of the barbecue. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're at the the mural that you get to paint, and I picked number seven, which was a little yellow color. But there are really no seven. So the guy told me to like touch up some some people's spots that you can still see the seven through. So I'm excited. <laughs> I painted my spot. Oh, I like had to bend down really low, and I'm like, now I'm like. I almost fell over. <laughs> I couldn't get back up. It was, it was a project, but this is what it's gonna look like. It's so cute. And also, um, like when I showed you before that the little paint containers made the flowers pink in the front, this one is a yellow. And over there, if you could see it, it's an orange. So that theme is like throughout. And I just, I think it's so like, so great. <laughs> Guardians of the Galaxy back there, Cosmic Rewinds. I love it so much. It's my favorite ride currently at this park, at all of Disney World, and I really do love it. Jer and Deb had to take a break, so I'm on my own right now, and so that's why our food, <laughs> our food reviews have paused. <laughs> but I went on the ride, and guys, when I got off the ride, I saw, I, I know that no one, no one even cares or knows who this is but as you know I'm a patreon of a, a patron of many many different things <laughs> one of which is my my favorite survivor podcast Rob has a podcast and there he was sitting there when I came off the ride with his family I did I I was so starstruck I was just like sorry there's a lash falling in my eye I like just quickly walked past but I was like oh my god it's Rob like I couldn't, and like his wife was there with him and the two kids, and I was, I just couldn't, I couldn't believe it. Um, and the podcast that they do together, the is my favorite one, and I was just like, oh my god, I, I, I wish I kind of wish that like I, I said something or at least like waved or like, acknowledged that this podcast is like so great, <laughs> but. I, I got scared. So I just needed to share that story. Um, 
Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Um, so we did stop at a couple more food booths along the way tonight, but um, it was too dark to like film anything, so I just kind of said, eh, whatever. <laughs> but we did have um, we did have a bunch of stuff from the Canada booth, which was fantastic. Um, I tried the bone marrow, and it was really good. Even Jer liked it, so proud of her. Um, and then we thought that we were getting beef tartare. <laughs> it was beet tartare with a T. Uh, so that was not, that's not what I was, it's upsetting when you think you're getting beef and then you get beets. So whatever, but Deb loved it, loved it. Um, and then we had some deconstructed booth stuff and that was also very good. And now, then we went on a couple rides and now um, I'm gonna go and watch Harmonious. So, because I really like it and apparently that's a unpopular opinion, but I'm gonna go watch it and that's going to be it for me for today, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Love you!